Hi Freya, how are you? Yeah, I'm good, thanks. How are you doing? Yeah, great, thank you. Um, so, um, fantastic news about the tour. Um, when, when did you learn about that? Uh, we knew it was an option for a while, but um, selection came out two weeks ago, I think. So it's all been a bit of a whirlwind trying to pack and do everything that New Zealand needed us to do to be allowed in their country. Um, but yeah, it's exciting. Were you in the middle of training for it anyway when, when the, the selection came through? Uh, yeah, we were already, we were all up training. Um, we had a bit of time off over Christmas, but we were up the first week in January training, um, hoping that there was going to be a tour at the end of it, but never quite knowing with the current climate what was going on. Yeah, at Loughborough, presumably. Yeah. Did, did you have the tent outside or, or, or was it all indoor? Uh, no, all indoor at the moment. The boys were using the tent when um, before they went, but um, we were just indoors. I think it's a bit easier logistically indoors. So, yeah. okay, okay, good. And um, been been working on anything in in particular? Uh, any coaching points that you can share with us? I've been doing a lot of technical stuff with my action. Right. Um, I mean, my fast bowling is all about straight lines, and everything we work towards is about getting things to go in straight lines, but. Um, also, batting-wise, we've talked a lot about those of us that bat kind of six and seven down, particularly in T20s, about what our role is and specifically working on that end of innings. Um, don't have many rules to mess around with. So, yeah, we've done a lot of power-hitting stuff, which is good fun. A big difference if you're six, seven down can, can contribute, can make a big difference in all forms of cricket, uh, but particularly T20, I guess. Yeah, definitely. It's... It gives our top order a bit more reassurance as well if they back us. That it allows everyone to play with a bit more freedom and okay. that actually if we're six or seven down, that's not an issue. Um, so yeah, it's good fun. Good. And talking of bats, um, did, did the new kit arrive in time? Yes, made it here. I will unveil it. Um, it looks very similar to my one that I love at the moment, which makes me very happy. Um, so did you tell the guys at the factory that you want to want exactly the same? Yes. So yeah, yeah. So that's 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 what we do. Um yeah. So I mean, unfortunately haven't hit many balls in my living room with it yet. Um, but we'll certainly be giving it a go once I'm out there. Pick okay. up great. Looks, great. looks nice, looks big. Uh, what's yeah. what, two eight? Two nine. Two nine. Okay. Um but with a slightly higher middle, so it gives it a nice pickup. It doesn't pick up like a two nine. Okay, great. Good that um, you've been working on your batting as well, and, and um, that, that looks like it's built for power hitting, so yeah, good. You're fortunate um, in, in, in the pro or the elite um, bubble, um, you, you can carry on, but cricket stopped for the amateur player, the junior player. Um, have you seen the stuff we're doing with this lockdown club? Yeah, I've seen bits and pieces on social media. We're just trying to put together some, some basic drills um, and, 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 you know, batting. Um, bowling, fielding, some fitness stuff. Um, so we've put a real good team together. And um, funnily enough, I was talking to, to Steve Kirby, who's our pace bowling um, guy involved. And, mm -hmm. and all he talks about is train lines and straight lines and targets. And um, yeah, yeah. so we're, we're going to be putting some real good stuff out there. I suppose as a pro cricketer, I mean, you can underpin that. It is all about the basics and, 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 and doing them well. Yeah, definitely. I think it surprises people that we still do, I mean, very basic drills. I stand and bowl between cones that are just in a straight line. Like nothing, nothing changes really the higher up you get. We maybe focus on some more specific stuff, but yeah, fundamentally, if you do the basics well, it doesn't matter what level of cricketer you are. That's hugely important. Yeah, okay. And, and, and talking about hopefully a summer full of cricket, um, obviously, you, you got back out there last summer, as did some club cricket. But um, you, you'd made the 100 team, and, and disappointingly, obviously, uh, that didn't go ahead. How, how's that looking for, for this year? Yeah, I mean, fingers crossed we'll get some more cricket in this year. Um, I have signed with the 100 team. I don't think it's been announced yet. Um, oh, okay. So not the, same, not the same one necessarily? Well, I think you'll find out in about a week or so. Oh, okay. Um, but, yeah, it's really exciting that that can go ahead. Obviously, it was a massive shame last year, um, but we wanted to do it properly. 
like it would have been a shame to have opened that behind closed doors so fingers crossed this year we can do it in style and yeah it'll be a really exciting Oh, watch this space. So when that's announced, perhaps we could do another one of these from New Zealand and you could update me and, and, and our audience on um, how, how the tour's going and what life's like over in New Zealand. Yeah, definitely. Oh. I mean, it wouldn't speak to me too much in the first 14 days because <laughs> I won't be able to tell you much of any excitement. Oh, is, is, it, is it a lockdown for two weeks when you get there? Yeah, we have, to be fair, the New Zealand government would be amazing. We've got a couple of exemptions. So from day... Well, potentially within the, within the second week, we might be allowed to do a bit of cricket training in very small bubbles, in very controlled environments. But yeah, it's fundamentally two weeks in a hotel room. OK, um, I can tell you you're very busy. You've got lots to do. Um, you fly when? Sunday? Sunday evening, yeah. Um, you have a great time. Thanks. And, um, and, and stay in touch and um, good luck with the tour and the cricket and, um, you know, stay safe. Sounds good. Thank you very much. See you later. Bye. See ya.